is very upset and disappointed. Me and Kevin was cool. That was my little friend. But <laughs> the first time I really got caught cheating. Let me try to get comfortable in this little cheap ass chair. Pull up in my hood, best dress. What you thinking? What's the fuck? How you feeling? I wish a nigga would. I da 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 da. Who got to fuck with the baddest? You know that I can't be kept. No, I gotta dip out. Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Simply Ned. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I'm not about to keep posting videos for y'all if y'all not gonna watch. But. Y'all clicked on that story because y'all seen that title, right? And it's very upset and disappointing. Like, how you get caught, girl? How you get caught? Let me try to get comfortable in this little cheap-ass chair. Okay. Y'all clicked on that story because y'all seen that title. And y'all probably like, girl, who you cheat on? Who, who, who you cheated on? How you get caught? Okay, but it's not that kind of story time. <laughs> Got it. <he>. Got it. <he. laughs> Hot. Got your neck. I wasn't cheating on nobody. I wasn't even cheating in the first place, right? I'm in my sophomore year of college. This is college. And I'm taking Spanish class. I think I'm taking like Spanish two. Yeah, I'm taking Spanish two because I already took Spanish one. Um, I had the same professor, so the lady knew me. I had had her last semester, so she knew me. She knew like I love Spanish. I be doing my work, stuff like that. So now that I'm saying, I'm not even understanding why you took it to the, why you had to do what you had to do. So. It was about, it was freaking finals, y'all. Finals. And you know, in college, that shit is serious. When you're taking your midterms, your finals, stuff like that, that stuff is serious. Don't mess with me around this time because I'm trying to focus. I'm trying to pass, okay? Um, I remember this one boy in my class. We're going to name him um Kevin. We're going to name him Kevin. And I'm like Kevin. Period. So, but when I first had that class, me and Kevin was cool. That was my little friend. Kevin was old. He was like, I could probably say like, he was probably like, let's say like, let's give him like 36. Okay. My sophomore year, I gotta be like 22. I'm like 22 my sophomore year. Gotta be like 22. So Kevin is like 36, right? So my Spanish class, the Spanish class was real easy. She used to give us like, we used to talk about the stuff in class and then she would give us the homework or something about the stuff we talked about in class so you couldn't fail the class because everything we talked about in class you write your notes she write she literally write the notes and you copy the notes and then when your homework it be in the notes so like it's no way of failing so we had our midterm the midterm we had it inside the classroom and a lot of people did good and some people didn't do so well so when she said that some people didn't do so oh, my lips a little dry hold on so when she said some people wasn't doing so well, um, she decided to let us take our finals home. She was like, all right, your final exam, we'll let you take it home. Um, because some people may do better taking tests at home. So I'm like, okay, bet. That's easy. So in my head, I'm really like, if she lets y'all take y'all final home and y'all still feel that's fucking sad because you could really be cheating at home, right? So that's probably why y'all like... Oh, that's why you got caught cheating because you were cheating on your final home. No. No. Okay. So, Spanish class, I never cheated in Spanish class. Ever. Like, I always knew my Spanish work. Like, I be knowing my hola, como estas, muy bien, gracias, y tu gracias. Boy, if you don't. I be knowing my Spanish stuff, for real. I be really knowing my Spanish stuff. So, when I had my final, I don't remember what happened. I remember the final was like, um... She gave us, like, this little packet. It probably had to be no more than five pages. Um, Some pages were, like, multiple choice. Some pages were, like, correct the sentence. You know, like, the basic Spanish work. It wasn't nothing hard. Like, you had to write your own. Yes, it was. The last page, we had to write our own. Um, we had to write a story or something, like, five sentences about ourselves in Spanish or something like that, right? So, 
when I went to class, the day the final was due, she was like, bring your final into class or whatever. So, um, cause we was going to have class that day cause she was still going to teach. So we bring our final in and when, um, Kevin came in the classroom, me and Kevin always sat beside each other. Cause for some reason, Kevin was never smart in Spanish class and he always asked me for help in Spanish. I also sat by this other girl, which is my friend. No, I did not sit by her. I did not sit by her. She sat, like, in front of me. I sat by this other girl, though, that I was cool with. I don't remember her name, but I, we will name her um, Stacy. I sat by Stacy in the class. So, Stacy was always helping me, and I was always helping Kevin. So, it was literally like Stacy was helping me, I was helping Kevin. Stacy was Spanish. She knew that. She knew She knew the shit. So, whenever I needed help, I would always go ask Stacy for help. And whenever Kevin needed help, he would always ask me for help. But sometimes, if I didn't know the answer, Kevin would just ask Stacy. Or sometimes we just ask the professor. Sometimes the professor would be in her own little world. She wouldn't even be worried about us. Because most of our work was always group work, class work, you know, stuff like that. We were always working together. So it was always me, Kevin, and Stacy, us three and the partners or whatever. Kevin was a little off. He was a little... I just, I don't know. I just felt like he was one of those old people that wanted to be young and wanted to be cool. And people like that just irritate me. Like, when you just be trying to fit in to fit in, you ain't fit in. So, Kevin was Kevin was giving me that kind of vibe. But it wasn't really bothering me because we was only in class for an hour. And after Spanish class, I don't really see y'all. So, I didn't really care. So, the day our final was due, we come to class. And I sit beside Stacy and Kevin, you know, my, my two he's in the pod that i be sitting beside so um i asked stacy i said how you think you did on the final imagine we still got our final sitting in front of us but nobody's like showing the answers it's like flipped over to like the blank side our professor didn't even come in the classroom yet she's still like i don't know i guess she i think she put like blackboard or something she was gonna be like 10 minutes late or something she was gonna be behind but we were just in class talking about the final some people came to class early so they could get help on their final you know cheat get help on their final but Everybody just came to class at regular time. So I was asking Stacy how she thinks she done her final. And she was like, girl, you know I did good, blah, blah, blah. So she was like, how do you think you did? And I was like, I honestly think I did good. I was like, um, it wasn't that hard. I said, the only thing that was really hard was the part in the back where I had to create my own story. I said, that kind, that part was kind of um difficult, I said. But I was looking at my notes, and I think I did good. So stacy asked kevin she said kevin how you think you're doing that on the uh final and he was like to be honest i only did one page so i'm sitting there like oh okay i guess he want to get an f then so then he was like um to be honest i was hoping uh one of y'all could help me with the uh the the last four pages so i ain't said nothing so I get to looking at my last page. <laughs> I get the uh peer review of my own work. Um, so he was like, to be honest, um, to be honest, shut the fuck up. We not helping you. We not. We not. To be honest, you're not getting my answers. Cap. To be honest, you better do that yourself. Cap. To be honest, let's just be honest. Just get that F. So he was like, to be honest, uh um, that's what I was saying in my head. But he was like, to be honest. I just need help. So I know the fuck. <laughs> what the fuck? So the professor come in. So we can't help you, Kevin. Uh, you gotta get that F. So the professor was like, um, she took attendance and she was like, just turning y'all final. And um, she was like, just turning y'all final. And y'all could go. That's all she did was come in and take attendance and turn be turned off final be left. So when I was leaving, Stacy Stacy kind of looked like she wanted to help Kevin, like she wanted to help him. So she was like, um, I can help you with with some of the pages, the ones that's multiple choice, but the one for your store, I can't help you with that because we all had to create our own and we all had to create our own stuff. So I'm like, yeah, that is true. So I helped him with probably like three questions, and then I turned my shit in and I left. Right? I turned my stuff in and I left. I get an email from the professor. Y'all, so imagine that it's a table, like, right here. And the students, like, on this side. And then the professor, like, sitting all the way in the back. But she on her laptop typing up whatever she's typing in. So she not even paying attention to us turning our phones. We just turning our stuff leaving. Turning our stuff leaving. Because some people is turning their stuff and they go back there and talk to, their, talk to her about their grades. So she not really paying attention to people turning in their assignments. So I turned in my assignment and I left. 
Um, I think I went to the student center probably, and I or probably got me some eat. I honestly don't remember what happened after that. But I remember the next day I got an email from the professor, and she was like, um. So I'm editing the story time now. I guess I forgot to mention that I told my mother, and I guess I don't know somehow they got in contact, and I guess her mother talk over the phone. But y'all gonna see the email. If I got the email, y'all, I swear to God, I will insert the email. I swear to goodness, I will insert the email. I got the email from the professor, and it was basically saying something like, um, I'm going to give you an F for the final, which means you're failing the class. You failed the class because um, something something you plagiarized or something like that. So I'm like, like, how the fuck did I plagiarize for some shit I created myself? Like, how the fuck I plagiarized? So... I emailed her back. I do not remember. I do not remember, y'all, because this is like two, three years ago. But, y'all, Kevin picked up my final and basically copied my own story. You know, the story we had to come up with with the five sentences on our own. He copied my five sentences on the back and put the same fucking five sentences on his paper and then turned his paper in. So, when she graded our papers, it really looked like he copied all five of my pages like and it it just got the same answer like got the same answer so i'm emailing my professor and i'm really like no you know i be doing my work in class like i turn all my work on time like that just don't make sense how all of a sudden i'm just failing like how i just plagiarize like how do you think i plagiarize if i'm really doing my all my work so i'm really trying to explain to her like i don't know what the fuck happened like i don't know what happened so y'all i swear to god when i seen kevin in the student center we was all playing space you know if you know me and my friends, we love to play spades. Mm -hmm. But all me and my friends, we playing spades or whatever. And I seen Kevin walk in the student center. So I got up and I walked up to Kevin. So I already I already told my friends the story what happened. So when they seen him walk in the student center, they was like, you need there he go. There he go, blah, blah, blah. So I walk up to Kevin. I'm like, why the fuck would you copy off my final? And he was like, uh. He was like, I didn't even know she'd be reading it. If the fucking instructions say to create your own five sentences about yourself, why do you think she's not going to read it? Why do you think she's not going to read it? So I said to Kevin, y'all, I swear to God, email him and everything. Because I, I emailed him too. And I said, I think I said, you need to email her and tell her that you copied off my paper. You need to tell her that. And he, I think he was emailing me back like, okay, yeah, I'm going to tell her. But he never fucking told her. Y'all, the end of the semester came. I failed the class. Had to take the shit over. But when I had to take it over, I had this um funny professor. And I really did like him. But I was honestly so, like, so annoyed because if you know in college when you get caught plagiarizing you don't just get caught plagiarizing and they fill your paper nothing like that they be wanting you to go through some court shit like some fake court shit for the university i was not trying to do none of that because i'm like i don't have proof or nothing they be wanting you to have proof like it's really like court they be wanting you to have your evidence all the other stuff i don't have evidence or none of this so i was not trying to go to like court for school like that's just doing too much for a fucking final i didn't even have nothing to do with like you should never copy it off my paper so yeah i was honestly upset like i was so mad i had to take the class over like why would you do that why but <laughs> the first time i really got caught cheating make sure y'all like comment and subscribe that's the end of this story time if y'all want some more story times down below please let me know i do have a lot of story times like college related because um it's a lot of weirdos in college and also it's a lot of dumbasses in college <laughs> so i do have a lot of story times um i just don't be knowing what kind of story times to give like this story time literally popped up in my head when i was in the shower like what the fuck what just made me think about that but yeah, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn y'all post notification bells on to know when the next the next time your girl posts. Um, I am about to be posting, but I'll probably post this today. So yeah. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. La, 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 la.